Hello and welcome to another Save the World video. This one is all about ventures. Now I've been grinding pretty hard on this, probably not as fast as others and I'm sure people have uh, reached level 50 already if that is the maximum. Now what I was going to do is I was going to collect all my rewards, save them all up to level 50 and then just use them at that point. But I've got now two weapon superchargers and uh, I'm just itching to use one. So I thought I'd record it. Uh, so I'm going to see this for the first time. Um, and if you've not seen how this works, then you're going to get to see it for the first time with me. Except I saw it first. <laughs> right, so first of all, let's go into the armory uh, in the resources. Now, the blue ones are the hero superchargers. Currently have two of them. Uh, the red ones are the survivor superchargers. Currently have 11 of them. Uh, five more is their next reward, I think. Uh, we currently have two trap superchargers and two weapon superchargers. Maybe we're going to get a third weapon supercharger. Uh, so for now, I'm just going to use one of the two. Uh, now, what this does, it lets you promote the weapon past its current level. But I honestly have no idea what that level is. If I need specific materials, whether I have those materials, or whether it's going to use Sunbeam. How is this going to work? Let's find out. So I am going to do not the ref. We are going to do Duh, 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 duh. Okay, it's hiding from me. There it is, Zenon bow. Alright, this, I love this bow. This with my uh, Raider Jonesy build. I think it's awesome. So, there's my current build. So, I'm on a constructor right now. So, these stats are not right at the moment. They're not as high as they could be. Should I say? If I was on, in fact, let me just go and do that now. Let's do that. Let's do that. So command. Oh, they want survivors. We want heroes. Hero loadout, and then we'll go to our rabbit raider Jonesy, and that's the build I'm currently using for him. Uh, so he's got the 225% critical damage. We've got preemptive strike, so that's a nice damage boost against full health enemies. Plasma arc. I never leave home without it. If anyone watches me on my streams or seen any other videos you know i'm a massive fan of plasma arc damage 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 explosive rounds because you're doing so many kills so fast with this build it's insane locked and reloaded uh you get the buff every time you pop an arrow in it's just every time you reload an arrow for five seconds to make sure you shoot fast extra 50 percent damage uh then we got survivor list um why not i like that it means i can get in the thick of it and then quick scope for the sniper damage. So this is a pure sniper damage build. So that's why we are going to do the Xenon bow. Now where was it hiding? It was hiding down here somewhere. There we are. So upgrade. So look at the stats now. So it's 84k damage. 212. Um, headshot. I don't think it's going to affect the crit chance or crit damage. I don't think those stats are going to increase. It would be nice if they did. But let's find out. Are you ready? Upgrade. Promote. Weapon supercharger plus weapon designs plus schematic XP makes a sunbeam xenon bow, which it currently is anyway. So here we go. Promote. Um, wait, promote again. Ah, so it doesn't increase it up like the old way where you pop the upgrade and then you can level up 10 levels and then you're up to you know say for example 150 so you can do this five times wow three maybe because if you notice on the no actually no it'd be five times because i think this one will make it two out of five stars okay so back so that is now a 133. And if I wanted to do it again, it would be a 136. Now we're on 87 and 218. So it was only a small increase, but it was there. So that, okay, it's instantly I've learned something as we've done this then. I, like I say, thought this was just a case of promote it, then you've unlocked the ability to boost it another 10 levels. Not the case. 
So this is a case now, if you really want to max that something out, you're going to have to stick. You're going to have to stick to the same weapon with, with all that you get. Now, I was considering, let's do it again then. So I was only going to do one. That was it. I was going to do one as I thought that's all you needed per weapon. So let's do another one. Let's make this a 136. So this is going to go from 87, was it? 87 and 218 to 89 and 224. Again, it's only a small increase, but headshot damage, an extra 6,000 damage. And you've got to bear in mind that's times 570% on a headshot critical. So it all stacks in the end. It does stack. So screw it, let's do it. 136. We have a 136 Xenon bow. So if we do this again, promote. That's going to go to a 139. Okay. We need to get now to the end. We need to get to level 49. Because I believe it will be level 49 that gives it. There may be another quest along the quest line that gives another one. But 136. That's where we're at. Now what I'm going to do is... I am going to do a couple of giveaways. I might as well do some giveaways on this now. It's a 136 before I upgrade it. Makes it a little bit more unique. Obviously based on the perks uh based where i've stopped the like you know what i mean so what's the day today it's friday technically for me by the time this video comes out it's gonna be saturday this this weekend so this sunday which will be the second i believe second of august this sunday uk evening 5 p.m onwards i am going to give away a few of these via the ticket system on the trade stream so if you want to get your hands on a 136 Xenon boat, there it is on the screen. There's the perks. There's the level. Obviously, your stats will differ. But if you want to get yourself one of these, maybe a couple of these, if you're lucky enough to win, um, Sunday. Come and get one this Sunday. Now, because I've invested in that Xenon bow, I definitely think we're going to have to invest in Rabbit Ranger Jonesy. We're going to have to go full on, full in, all eggs in one basket, completely build up that sniper damage build. So that will increase more damage further. Definitely. Right. There's no point of dragging this out. That's how it works then. There are my weapon superchargers gone. I also use the uh, hero voucher. That would have been there as well. I've still got the weapon voucher. Not used that. Uh, Survivor superchargers. Oh, again, that can be put in. Because there's 11 of them. There's going to be 16 of them. Not collection. But what do we want? We want? Command. Survivors. Squads. Now, all my squads are maxed out. As you see, on 131. I took out the Mythics. Which would have boosted me a little bit further. Uh, I've still got them. You can't delete them. I've still got one in there. Because they didn't match the leader. But it still got me to 131 without them. But if you now pump more. So how many got in there? You got 7, 8. So you got 8 in there. You're going to get 16 total. So technically if you wanted to. You could put all of these upgraded. Unless. No. Again it's going to work a different way. You might have to focus just on one. If it works the same way. It's only going to go up one level. So yeah. Put it all in fire team alpha I'd say. For me. For the offence boost my damage just that little bit more uh, what's this one up here that's a 993 I think that's what it's going to have to be that sniper build is going to be sick as soon as that bow's done as much as I can get out of this season and all my survivors are done and my hero perks are done I will do a video of the complete build the xenon build with the rabbit raider um, fully stacked out I'm looking forward to that that's going to be banging it's going to be banging. All right, I hope you enjoyed this. It's quite overwhelming, to be honest, because, like I say, I didn't know what was coming, and I wasn't expecting that. Other people may have done research. You may have seen other videos. I had no idea I was going to do that, um, but I'm not someone that sits there and watches loads of different videos. I just get on with it. That's me. That's why I'm level 46, is it now? 47. So close. So close. And they've got to launch the rocket as well. I've not done it yet. I doubt it's going to do anything, but 
I think it's quite cool that that's at the end. It's a shame it doesn't give some cinematic. If it doesn't, who knows? It may do. Either way, that's it. That is the weapon done. 136. If you want to win one, come in the Save the World trade stream this Sunday. Um, I'll announce in the afternoon via the chat bot what time it's going to start. It'll all be on the screen. You're going to need to use your stream bucks, which you earn from being in the stream. So when you're in the stream, which is live 24 hours a day, it's now been up for over two years solid, non-stop, to save the world players and traders and crafters. Come in Sunday, win yourself a weapon. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, hit subscribe. There will be a hero one coming soon, and I'll do the trap as well, the survivor squads, that build. I've got loads of videos to come now. I've got some content on the game. Finally, something fresh. See ya soon.